it will not be local high school football, but gridiron action is returning to Lad People Stadium. Major League Football, a new professional spring football league, has chosen Mobile as one of its four home cities. The team will arrive in a little more than a month. Officials there say they'll be pouring millions of dollars into the local economy just so they can get started. Here's NBC 15's Corey Pippen. Football is returning to Lad People Stadium, and while no, it won't be your familiar high school teams, it will be a brand new product known as Major League Football, seeking to, quote, become America's home for spring professional football, which has chosen Mobile as the home for its... Alabama Airborne Team. Usually when you come across an, an opportunity like this, they want you to pay them to come in. So in this case, they were paying all the freight. Danny Cordy, Mobile Sports Authority's executive director, says the Florida-based league, which also has teams in Virginia Beach, Little Rock, Arkansas, and Canton, Ohio, is bringing all its players and coaches to Lad People Stadium for a training camp in July, leading up to two games in August before its inaugural season next spring. Approximately 400 personnel, which would stay in the hotels, eat in restaurants, and spend a lot of money. They were going to pay Lad People Stadium a non-refundable rental fee. We're estimating between a three to four million dollar economic impact. Mobile Mayor Sandy Stimson released a statement today on the announcement, saying in part, quote, we are excited. Not only will these events make a significant economic impact and provide entertainment for Mobilians, I know the hundreds of visitors traveling with the MLFB will enjoy all that Mobile has to offer. We are known as a sports city. I don't know what kind of happened to that, except for the fact that there's so many things on television now. But I'm hoping that something like this will bring people out. We hope that the league is successful long term, but whether they are or not, it gets income to LAD, which we all know they need that, and it gets income to the city and the county. Alabama Airborne will take on Ohio Force at LAD Peebles August 9th and Arkansas attack on August 16th. Now, if the league is successful, the Airborne will begin a full season at Lad Peebles next spring. As we keep a close watch on our city's newest team, you can get all our updates. Just follow NBC 15 on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and at mynbc15.com.